what is going on guys i know it's been a while since i made an actual weekend or long video i've been doing a lot of shorts uh, i've actually been growing my short community a little bit a little bit more than my regular vlog community just because it's so easy for me to get those get those videos done and um i just don't really have that much time on my hands but what i am going to do is start doing these weekend vlogs i feel like on the weekends i have a little bit more time on my hands not that I feel like it, I know I do. Um, it is the day after the after day of Thanksgiving. I've been home, I've been a little bit under the weather. So today I actually have to go take care of a couple of things. I'm gonna go run around, uh, check out on one of my parking accounts. And I'm gonna just bring you guys along with me so you can see how my day goes or how my weekend goes. Let's just see how this plays out. And um, I'm gonna try to be a little bit more consistent with this. Yes, I know I say that, but um, let's give this shot a try. Guys, so a lot has changed since the last video. Um, I got this new truck. I'll show you guys in a second. I'm just gonna jump in the truck, warm it up, cause man, it's cold out here. It is I think 30 degrees, 40 degrees outside today in New York City. But yeah, a lot has changed, a lot. Since the last video I did was when I was in the Lambo. Um, this vehicle <coughs> is in demonstration mode. Connected by button. So I got this truck and I don't even know how to take that feature off. So if anybody has a 2020 GMC or a Chevy and knows how to take this feature off, please let me know in the comments below. But yeah, I had this truck <clears throat> for about a month now, I think. Or a couple, three weeks. And I... I had tow trucks before, but I just got this truck again because I have gained a new parking account. And I'm actually going to, like, little by little get myself into that. And I have a lot, a lot, a lot of new things pending and in the works that I want to bring you guys along with me. Again, I know I've been slacking with this YouTube thing, but I'm actually going to make the effort and sacrifice. Let's put this down to make this a consistent thing yes i have a box of hoodies the 110 all the body hoodies but yeah make it a consistent thing and hopefully we can take this community somewhere because again i really want to do i really want to make this a, a, a for sure thing an always thing for you guys a lot of people want to see what i do out throughout my days or my weekends but um yeah i'll show you guys the truck in a second let me just get to the shop i'm gonna go pick up my boy joel so you can ride along with me today because sometimes I don't like being alone. But um, <clears throat> yeah, uh, I'll show you guys the truck once I get to the shop. Yo, it feels so weird driving after like two days of not driving. Sometimes you get tired of driving, but damn, this shit feels so weird. I feel so weird driving right now. Like, yeah, maybe it's the truck. I mean, I don't know. I just feel weird. It's been all right i am here at the shop so i just wanted to show you guys the truck all right this is my 2020 gmc sierra 3500 at4 i got my lifting tow unit installed on it i still haven't done the springs and additional leaf springs on the back but i'll be doing that soon uh this is my new baby this this happened in the matter of time that I uh, wasn't vlogging, which I should have been doing that because maybe you guys wanted to know how I put this setup together and how this came about being. But yeah, this is this is my new baby. This is what I'm working with. If you guys want to know how I put a setup like this together or how you can build a tow truck, I'll be making a separate video showing you guys how to put a setup together for a tow truck. This is maybe the cheapest way, maybe not this exact truck, but I'm not going to get into details. I'm going to just make another video to show you guys and to explain how you can make a setup just like this. But yeah, this is my baby. This is my new truck. This is my bread and butter aside from what I do at the shop and the other things I do. But yeah, that's it. I'm ordering some food because I haven't eaten anything yet. I'm at the deli. Y'all know, y'all know, New York. Shouldn't probably be eating this, but getting a little cold cut just to get my day started and the tea. Uh -huh, look. Esto es lo que me va a hacer rico a mí, loca. Rico millonario, rico, rico millonario, rico millonario, rico. Estás viendo y vas a ir. ¿Y por qué seguridad tuya? No, hay seguridad no. Tú vas a hacer eh, otra cosa. No seguridad. Yo no voy a necesitar eso. <laughs> Alright, so we are on our way to one of my parking accounts right now. Uh, do 
some routine check-in. We're gonna do a little bit of patrolling today, Saturday night. A lot of people are disrespecting the rules, not following the guidelines when it comes to parking on the property. So <clears throat> while we at it, I'm gonna show you guys as well how beautiful the view is there and how cold it can get because it's right next to the water. So, stay tuned. Hopefully I don't get into any fights today, which I normally don't do, because I'm a really respectful person. All right, so for those who don't know what I do, I'll get it for like maybe the hundredth time. I manage an auto body shop and I do towing. So I do a little bit of everything in the automotive field. <clears throat> deal with rentals, uh, towing, mechanic work, not too much mechanic, uh, customization, a little bit of it. Uh, one second. But mainly focus on auto body. That's like my biggest thing, I can say. And I do a little bit of towing occasionally because I have a truck now. <clears throat> but I... That's what I did before. Towing was like my 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 main thing. Um, and just when you're in the automotive field, like towing, obviously you're involved with the body shop things and you know stuff like that. But I originally started towing, and then I got into the body shop field maybe two three years ago. But I've always been around the body shop, like even from a long time ago. But towing was like my main thing. I like really like towing. <clears throat> but as time goes, obviously you want to find what can make you uh, more money. Not really, but be a little bit more comfortable. So I kind of got involved into the body shop business. And here I am. You know, I have my truck that I you know, use as a daily and do my towing occasionally. <clears throat> because I haven't really marketed myself big when it comes to towing. I've been marketing myself a lot for the body shop business, like uh, you know, the auto body specialist that I am. Um, but yeah, that's just a little quick, you know, recap or you know, little thing about me. So you guys know, a lot of people always ask me why I don't have my own shop. Why this? Why that? Like, well, mainly why I don't have my own shop. So I don't have my own shop not because of the funding part of it. It's mainly because I chose not to have that stress. Because having a body shop is stressful. Having a business itself is stressful. But <clears throat> I just didn't really want to get into that yet until, like, you know, I'm a little bit more comfortable with myself uh, financially and just mentally period so you know that did play a big part but not saying I will never have a shop that's probably one of my goals one day to do that maybe in the works so <clears throat> yeah that's just how I feel about that and I've been doing this for a while so those who know, know, know it's, it's, it's long overdue already that I do have my own place, which I'm, you know, completely comfortable where I'm at now. 110 is like my home. That's my place as well. You know, I'm, I'm, that's, that's, that's me. That's all me. So there's a lot of things in the work that you guys are going to be seeing in this channel soon. So just stick around. I want to make this channel as interesting as possible. I want it to be engaging. I want to engage with my, with my followers, with my viewers, with my subscribers. And I want to bring you guys into a community, into a family that you know, is not really <clears throat> shown out here with this body shop world or automotive world in New York City because I haven't yet to seen anybody that's doing what I'm doing. Here we go with this guy, bro. Yep, New York City, man, this traffic is retarded. People don't know how to drive. But, yeah, haven't been doing anything like what I'm doing. So, I kind of want to make this 
a thing, you know? Hopefully, it'll inspire other people to do something like what I'm doing and just, you know, bring awareness into this industry that a lot could be done and that you don't need much to get it done. I am right now going into the second part of the property. There's three sections of the property and they all have beautiful views of the city which like inspire me. Shit. Look at this view. I don't know if you guys can see it but it's pretty dope, right? Alright, so it looks like we actually might have something. A whole bunch of cars parked over here. They're not supposed to be parked. But let me just verify all these cars really quick. So, we got our first victim of the night. Light is super bright. We got this Pathfinder that was legally parked. I thought I was going to get on tonight, but I already started off my night with the first car. I am staging it right now. I'm going to bring it back to the yard. If in 20 minutes no one answers for the car, I bring it back to the yard. And then we'll come back and hopefully we got another one. All right, so customer just released this vehicle. We are gonna drop it in front of the building for them. That's why I love this truck so much. Some cheese going up. Let's see that. Anybody's in some spirit? I don't mean to be one anybody's day, but I get all the management on the property. Alright, so we got another one. It's parked literally right in front of the building. It's not supposed to be parked, but we're closing this out because they want us to shut it down. Alright, guys, so I'm hungry. Got a car hooked. I'm about to get some food right now. Tacos, bye. Ooh. Look at that. Just looking at this truck makes me hungry. Everything looks so good. Let me get a quesadilla. A quesadilla from here. It's okay. I didn't eat that last time. But today I'm gonna get it. It is break outside. Of course, I got my camera out. Look at my truck. It's raining like I really need to do a spring on my truck. The car has it like a single in the back, but. We'll do for now. I see my snap on jacket. Tatu no la tiene. no la Oh shit, it's frozen. Oh shit. Oh shit. So I was thinking I'm gonna do these daily weekend vlogs. So I'm gonna split it up into Saturday, Sunday maybe. Again, I do wanna do this really consistent, but Throughout the week, my days get really, really busy. So I can't promise Monday through Friday, but it will be dope to bring you guys along with me throughout the week to show you guys what my day consists of, how I spend my days, and you know, my 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 what and about. But the weekends is when I have a little bit more time for myself again, and I'm able to you know grab this camera and show you guys throughout my day. But um. Tomorrow I have something super dope planned out that I'm going to bring you guys along with me. It's a really, really, really special thing that I've been wanting to do for a really long time. And um, hopefully you guys like that as well. I'm going to make that super dope. This is something I'm really excited to show you guys and to bring. It's going to be a totally new thing. Well, not new thing, but well, yeah, it's going to be something new. And I have a lot planned for this channel. And again, I'm trying to keep it as consistent as I can. So your guys' support is huge for me. And I really appreciate the guys and the girls that watch this channel and you know actually interact with me, give me likes, follow me, and support my, my channel and my social media platforms as well. So uh, I'm gonna wrap this video up for today here. 
I don't want to make it too long because tomorrow is going to be a great day. It's like a hell of a day tomorrow. I'm planning everything out as we speak. Um, but yeah, hope you guys like this video. Tomorrow I'll catch you guys on the next video. And um, yeah, subscribe, like, and comment what you'd like to see in the future. So you guys can give me a little bit more ideas for the channel. Thank you guys. Catch you later.